I can't give you any words of wisdom, but if you ever need anything, I'll be around. You're not going to school? No. Not yet, anyway. Do you feel bad about that? I don't know. Maybe it's not what I'm supposed to be doing, you know? And besides, somebody has to hold down the fort while everyone else is gone, right? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I'm going out to Denver. And plus, you know, whenever they think about home, they'll think about me. And I can live with that. Even if they're gone and you're still here? Yeah. I mean, sure, we may no longer be friends, but that doesn't mean that they'll forget about me. You can go. Yes, sir. You. you come with me. Yet, as a country, we will never tolerate our security being threatened, nor stand idly by when our people have been killed. We will be relentless in defense of our citizens and our friends and allies. We will be true to the values that make us who we are. And on nights like this one, we can say to those families who have lost loved ones to Al-Qaeda's terror, justice has been done. Alright, this is getting ridiculous. Adorable. Okay, listen, if you if you tell anyone about this, I will beat you with a small child. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? If you tell anyone about this, I'm gonna post this to Lonnie Talbot's Facebook wall. Okay. Obviously, no more work is going to get done tonight. Do you want to go to the movies? I can't. I'm saving up for a McChicken later. If you're a man, you'll know it. You'll feel it. And no, not in your penis. I became a man because of that woman right there. We, we didn't do any, anything, though. So... Um, Lena... You dropped my ball. Figuratively, though. Unfortunately. You made me a man because you made me want to be more than just a guy with a penis, a descended testicle, and an undescended testicle. I want to be a guy. Nay, I want to be a man with you. And I'd love it if I could... Maybe take you out for some right. coffee or something afterwards. Yeah. So what do you say? Yeah.